I'm giving myself some grace today and saying I can't do it all. I cannot do it all. <laughs> you cannot do it all. So I ain't cleaning today. So I. Do you recall when we were young, running from all things at once, without thinking twice? wet hair. Good morning. Sunshine on my face. Directly on my face. Vitamin D y'all. So I'm going to target. So I'm going to be doing zone two today, but I think I'm going to do it um, vlog style. So this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the pants that I showed in the previous video. They are a little big, like right here, but you can't see it with this thing. Um, maybe they'll shrink with the um, with the when I when I put it in the wash. That's why I end up buying them a little big because they end up shrinking way too much. But um, I don't know. I think they're meant to be pajamas, but I don't care. I don't really know. Um, I like this brand, Elios. Really good quality. I've liked everything that I bought from them. I might go ahead and get a second pair. These are really comfortable and it's an option other than leggings because sometimes, I don't know. Sometimes I don't like the leggings. I do, but I don't. I wanted some, I wanted options. So I'm headed to Target and then I'll come back and clean. So yeah, batteries, I ordered the wrong ones. And that shirt that I showed in the last video, it's weird. It's some kind of weird parachute Weird material. I, yeah, if there's any doubt, take it back. So that's my new thing. Because <laughs> I'm not a take it backer. So on these ones I've had for a while, I'll have to check. And I'm taking it to Kohl's. You can return Amazon things at Kohl's. You don't even have to package them up. I mean, I went ahead and put this in there because I still had the that part of the packaging, but the package that it comes in, you don't even have to do that. You give them to this, you show your phone, they scan your phone of the items that you bought and boom, done, then they send it to you and how easy is that? Oh, and I think I'm gonna get uh, a new mount and I got this. This is my sister's plate um, from Christmas. I brought hubby back food. We had lamb and then I bought her a pair of these owl socks. And, um, yeah, and then this is, um, my sister's wedding. I don't know. Hubby was, um, uh, cleaning out his man cave and it was in a box. I have no idea why we had her, um, yeah, tape. I'm probably going to slide. I need to put that in the seat or something. So I guess I'm going to go to, hold on, turn the can camera off and inadvertently, whatever. Anyway, if you noticed in my um, 2021 video, if you haven't seen that video, go watch. I know it's kind of long. Get yourself a cup of coffee and watch it. Maybe uh, at night before you go to bed. It's a long one. It's like 54 minutes long, but I don't know. I think it's pretty good. Pretty good video. And anyway, the point of that was is the camera was like up here, and I was like, I look pretty good. See, look. Isn't that much better? Mm-hmm. You can see my fatness. <laughs> so, I, I mean, I don't think I'm gonna, unless I get one that mounts way up high. And anyway, so, um, yeah, this is not a good view. I definitely like myself better in <laughs> Anyway, going to Target. I totally am not like it. So much better. Mm-hmm. So, I, when I go to Kohl's to drop off that stuff, um, I'm going to go to Five Below, which is a couple stores down, which is across the street from Target. It's all in one place, um, about 20 minutes-ish. And then, I missed my chiropractor appointment on Monday, so I'm gonna call them and reschedule. Usually I can just drop by, but I don't know if they let you do that anymore. You just pop in, um, which is right by my sister's. 
the chiropractor. Seriously, it's in her neighborhood. Um, I'm going to drop off that plate and the DVD and then the pair of socks and probably chit chat with her for a while about some things that we have to take care of. My parents' house. We have to start decluttering it and getting rid of all of my mom's things, all of her clothes. You would have thought that we had, would have done that by now, but we did get all rid of, you know, because she didn't need them. And obviously I'm not going to be adding that to this video. Maybe I'll take it out and put it in another video and call it a card log. Yeah, so if I'm doing that, just know that this was an excerpt from my zone two cleaning video and um that i'm just calling it a, a car vlog so i think maybe that's what's going to happen here so weird right anyway okay i'm going to go i think i'm gonna go to kohl's first because i'm thinking after target i'm gonna be too tired and like i don't get it so i'm gonna go to kohl's first and then go to five below you know what? I need to pop in Marshalls too to get my hair cracked. Yes. <laughs> Look, I'm all out. And um, yeah, that's where I get it. You can get it on Amazon too, and I'll put the link down below. But sometimes the price is jacked up ridiculous. Although, I think right now it's. I mean, it is still. I'll see how much the difference is. So, I believe the one in right currently is. $24 at um, on Amazon for the 16 ounces. I know you guys think that's expensive. I don't really know. Probably. My problem is, is um, it wouldn't seem so bad if I wouldn't use it so often, which I stopped doing. So I only use it once, once a week. Okay, that's a lie. Because <laughs> I used it twice in a row recently. Because my hair is really bad. When my hair is really bad and feels dry. And the weather's really dry here um, right now. And um, so my hair feels really dry. And so I used it last night in my hair. I went to bed with my hair wet. That's why it looks funky. And I woke up. Oh my God, it was like this. <laughs> Literally. It was like that. It was ridiculous. So I need to run into Marshall's too and see if I can find some hair crack and maybe look at some Valentine's stuff. Should I do that? I'm thinking not. Um, this I can return to Kohl's. Um, this is giving me a refund without returning it. Literally. I don't know. I guess, you know, sometimes they do that. So I bought the wrong size. It's chart rechargeable batteries for the, um, uh, I guess it's Amazon, so it's not worth it for them to have it shipped back to them. So I bought AAA. I needed AA for the landscape lights. So I don't even have to return that. They're refunding me anyway. And then this one, it broke. And um, it doesn't work anymore. It's to put potpourri in. And um, yeah, it doesn't work anymore. It worked like twice. And then I tried to turn it on one day and it didn't work. So, um, I can't hit return it at Kohl's. I have to package it up. Frankly, I'm thinking that ain't happening. <laughs> I'm terrible about that. I have to package it up and bring it to UPS. Yada, yada, yada. This, I just take right into Kohl's right now. And boom. They just scan my phone. And it is gorgeous today. And I should get out shopping earlier more often. It's like what 9 30 because there's hardly anybody in the parking lot awesome 15% off thing um when you return something it's a win-win for them right <laughs> i'm sure amazon pays them to do it too that's a cute basket but that's way too much money why wouldn't get one half off i'm just gonna look real quick i don't i don't i don't really need anything oh uh, wait i wanted a pillow that's right I was gonna get a pillow at oh and here's Valentine's stuff. I wanted a pillow. It's supposed to be a car vlog. <laughs> Guess not. 
I wanted a pillow for my bed. I've been trying my best for a while, trying to please everyone who's around me. I've been putting on my fake smile, even though I'm wasting time. I don't want to be trapped in a box, trying to be like the rest, but I'm not. I just want to go my own way, kind of let the past burn down, cause honestly, I don't want to be stuck in boring conversations with you, with you. I'm gonna leave it all behind, find myself, I'm gonna start with new. Yeah, I'm on my way now. Okay, they didn't have anything that I wanted. I'm like, Michelle, just because you have a coupon doesn't mean you have to buy something. Anyway, so I didn't buy anything. I'm turning around. Going over to Five Below. And um, see if they have a camera mount thing. And then I'm going to go to Target. Alright, so I bought one, but I can't open it. I need a knife. It's not happening. Well, I'll have to try that out later, and then I'll buy some boom chick pop white cheddar popcorn. Go on Target. I almost forgot. I gotta go to Marshall's so I can get my hair cracked. Because I'm a hot mess. Look at this hair today. I know that you are having a hard time right now That everything seems to crumble around you I know that you feel all alone in this world But you have to Put your trust into us and we will help you through Cause we only want what's best, what's best for you I know that you are having trouble believing right That everything is gonna be, is gonna be alright I know that you feel all alone in this world But you have to put your trust into us and we will help Oh, my hair is, keeps getting worse as the day goes on so who am I kidding? I'm not going home and cleaning. I'm, um, I don't know. You know, I wake up and I feel good. Well, after about an hour anyway. And then, then I'm like, oh, I got all this energy. <laughs> and then I do, do something. I don't have any energy. So you want to see what I got. So I don't know when I'm going to post this. But uh, I got some of the coconut milk Alba Botanica shampoo. Um... I'll scan it and let you know what it is on the Think Dirty app. So, I think it scans pretty good. Let me do that right now. Okay, so this rated a four. It, if it's three or less, that's considered in the green, which is clean. And then four is um, half and half. But only one ingredient in here, final something or another. Um, phenol. I don't know. I can't. Phenol, thiol, 
something. I don't know. <laughs> was not well. It's, it said it wasn't. It was saying not that that bad. So if you if you download the Think Dirty app, you can just scan the bar the UPC code at the store to see whether if if it's good or not. Um. So that I Alba products are pretty good. Now I recently bought the Alba um conditioner Plumera. It smells so strong, it's ridiculous. And usually that's what rates bad is is um, fragrances, guys. So that's usually the bad thing in products. So if it smells really strong, it's probably not good. Yeah, it's probably toxic. Well, I don't know about toxic, but... Hey, listen, if you use these things maybe one time, it's fun. But if you use it time after time, and if you use like 10, in, 10 things in one day, and they're all sort of kind of like a little toxic <laughs> they rate up bad um on the think dirty app you've done use two things that day or 10 things that day that were bad so it's yeah speaking of which <laughs> yeah so this was $19.99 so on amazon the 16 ounce right now is $24.99 so definitely cheaper um they had I showed it. They had one that is um, vegan. Um, I'm guessing it's the same brand, but it said macadamia, but it looked the label looked different. So, but it said 100% vegan. But when I scanned it, it didn't come up on the app because they that means they have not researched that particular product, probably because it's new and stuff. So. Um, so this rated, let me down. All right, it's an eight. Not good. So again, it was the fragrance. There were three ingredients that rated a four and the rest of them were clean. So, um, which was a three. So, yeah. But that's the other reason why I started only using it once a week instead of every day or every time I wash my hair. I used to wash my hair every day, but now that we're staying home and stuff, um, it's like every other day, sometimes every three days. Um, my hair looks atrocious when I don't wash it. Look, <laughs> I mean, I didn't wash it today. I washed it last night and it just, it just looks atrocious when I don't wash it. So there's that. So I got another strainer for the other side of the sink. I have one on one, the garbage disposal side, but not on the other side. And I don't know, stuff gets stuck in the drain. And the other side. I bought some of the oregano tomato basil. And I didn't tell you prices. This was $3.99. The, this was $10.99. That's a huge bottle. It is 32 ounces. That should last a long time. If they had the coconut milk um, conditioner, I bought it. They had the Gardena um, conditioner. I didn't smell it, but I don't like gardenia, and I'm guessing it's it's it smelled bad. I don't worry about spices as far as rating goes and stuff, because it's so it's so minor. <sighs> sometimes I buy organic ones, sometimes I don't. I mean, how much are you using? It's fine. So this is roasted garlic, rosemary, and sea salt. I thought that looked pretty. Pretty good. So that was $3.99 and the other one was $3.99. That's a pretty large thing of that. And I probably won't even decant this and put it in a mason jar. It's in glass. It's good to um, store spices in glass. That's why one of the reasons why when I buy them from the store, if they're in plastic, um, I'll put them in a mason jar. And sometimes if they're in glass, I still would too because it's just easier because I like the big, big container. And then it's cohesive in my cabinet too. Anyway, so I, that. Okay, so I got a frying pan. Um, so I'm going to get rid of the one I have. So I have a Teflon pan. It's really, really, really good for for cooking um bacon in. But I realized it's tea fell. I inherited it from my son from college. <laughs> 15 something years ago, not 15, 12, 12 years ago. No, eight years ago. When did he graduate college? I don't know. He's 32. He did graduate college late because it took him five years to graduate. Cause he had, 
Let me end this story. So the first um, semester of college, he got mono. So I believe he had to drop out of one or two classes because he had mono bad. So, and then he, the, this is a child that never got sick, really. He hardly ever was absent from school. Well, that's not true. For being sick, he wasn't absent. Listen, I don't, you know, people go crazy about not making, not um having their kids absent from school. And they even give kids an award for not missing any school days. And that's great and all and, and everything like that. And I, know, and I know you need to, um, I don't know, encourage your kids to do that. But, you know, you need a day off. <laughs> we need a per. Hey, when you work, they give you a personal day. One, usually, they give you one personal day a month paid so that you can go to your doctor's appointments and, and everything like that. So, um, he was, I believe he was allowed nine days um, a month when he was in high school. A month. Uh, a semester. And um, in his junior and senior year, he took them all. The boy still had straight A's, so I didn't care. He, you know, it was fine. Anyway, so, um, anyway, the point of that was is he hardly ever got sick. So the first semester he got mono. And then, um, did he get, I want to say he got pneumonia, walking pneumonia one, one uh, semester. And then another semester, um, and so then he started taking summer classes because he was home the first summer. Then the other three, four years, he didn't, um, actually it was four and a half years or was it five and a half? I don't know. <laughs> uh, so I don't remember. So, um, this is the boy who got a hundred percent on his SATs. I believe it was the perfect score of 800. They don't score it like that now. He took it twice. He took the math or the math portion. He took it twice because he wanted to, he scored really good. And he says, I want it. I want to get, I want to take it again so I can get a hundred percent on it. And he did anyway. So anyway, he got, uh, that. So, uh, <laughs> uh, where am I going with this? So, um, and then, so he ended up taking summer classes. And then one summer he ended up getting uh, appendicitis and he had to get his appendix out. So he missed that all some one one whole summer, even though he was trying to make up classes. He had to drop out of, out of his all of his classes for that semester. Anyway, so he ended up um, and he took really hard classes. So he didn't take he didn't take sometimes he didn't take a full load of classes, and uh, yeah, he ended up. What was the point of telling you all of that? Because yeah, I don't remember. Anyway, so let me finish this. So, um, oh, cause I, now I remember, cause I was telling you I got the pan from him from college cause his roommates left all the dishes for him. He was the last one to move out and then got a ton of dishes and that was one of them. It was a nice pan, but, and it cooks bacon really good, but it's toxic. So I'm going to throw that away and I bought this for, it's a nonstick pan. It's one of those and I'm not sure cause this whole, you see this thing, you know, those, 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 uh, infomercial things is from one of them, or I don't know. Anyway, but it does say that it is copper infused ceramic, and I was going to get the round one, but I kind of like this, this square one, and I like the handle on it. The other one was black, and I kind of like the handle on this. We'll see how this goes, um... Yeah, I've got to get rid of the tea fowl. So, it cooks bacon really good. And sometimes you just want to cook something with a non-stick pan. Um, we'll cook bacon. I'll be cooked it in the regular... The, what do you call those pans? The stainless steel pans? I made a mess. I'm like, don't cook it in that. He's like, your heart's fine. We're not going to use that other pan. Yeah. <laughs> it was... It was a mess. I had to get the... Um, what do you call it? Steel wool pad? And it, I soaked it and then I had to use the steel wool on it. I'm going to Target. 
and I'm pooped right now. So, all right, so I'm gonna give myself some grace. I forget who it was it. Nancy, was it you? Was it you, Barbara? I, I don't recall. Somebody said, because in my um, 21 by, by 21, 2021 video, um, my year end, my year in review video, I said, I'm gonna give my husband some grace. And one of you said, I, I never remember who it is. It, uh, I'm gonna say it was Barbara, but maybe not. Anyway, you know who you are. So, um, I'm just going across the street. I'm not putting this seatbelt on, although I should because it makes noise. All right, I'll just put it on. It's, it's across the parking lot. I'm not even going on the road. So, um, you said I, I needed to give myself some grace. So I'm giving myself some grace today and saying I can't do it all. I cannot do it all. <laughs> You cannot do it all. So I ain't cleaning today. So I cleaned yesterday too. So I'm trying to film, a, um, I'm trying to film um, zone one, two, and three and show you what a whole week of zone cleaning look like, looks like in a week. <laughs> so much for that. Cause yeah, I didn't clean on Monday because I was filming the year end review and that video was a bear. A bear. See, my hair looks better when I do like that. Um, I do need a haircut. Don't I always need a haircut? My hair grows too fast. I take so many supplements. I think that's what makes it grow so fast. So, it took me the whole, literally the whole entire day. Now, I did take some breaks because I got tired of editing. And it took me the whole entire day to um, edit the video. And so I didn't end up getting um, it done. And then I didn't end up doing my zone cleaning. So I did it yesterday. But that's why my zone cleaning routine, my one and done zone cleaning routine is um, flexible. So if something comes up that day, I, it, it's either, so it's three days, one week, and then two days, the next, the next week. And then I'm supposed to do week, just daily chores in between. Yeah. It doesn't really happen anyway so on the weekends it happens but um which is fine the house is actually clean enough so i ended up cleaning yesterday tuesday instead of monday and then so did today's wednesday and uh i was supposed to do that today and then friday is um zone three but it can be moved it's flexible so I'll do zone two tomorrow, which is an easy zone because that's just the dining room and the um, library and the um, laundry room, right? Just that, that, yeah, that's it. Just the dining room, the, laundry, the library and the laundry room. And those are really easy because they don't really get messed up too much. We don't live in those rooms. <laughs> We, I, we do use the room, but not consistently like we do the family room. And lately, we've been hanging upstairs in the, um, in hubby's man cave. That's a mess. Plus, we're redoing it and stuff like that. So, um, I'm help, and I'm deep cleaning it while hubby's redoing his shelves and rearranging his stuff and, um, that he keeps in there. And, um, he has collectibles. You've probably seen a few of them because I tried not to show them but I did end up showing some of them but anyway so there's that um write in the comments below do you does your husband have collectibles you know what I'm talking about anyway so um hey we women collect things too but apparently it's okay for women to collect dishes but it's not okay for men to collect those other things I don't know I don't want them displayed about what else <laughs> anyway so um, I don't know. What, what, what was I going to say? It's brain fog. Oh, I'll do zone two tomorrow. Oh, that's what I'm going to say. It's pretty easy. I think I'm going to do the front porch. You may have already seen that video by the time I post this one. Uh, I think I'm going to add cleaning the front porch into that because I need to take down the Christmas. So I need to take everything on the front porch down and um, the rest of the stuff and the dining room and the uh, library that is Christmas. I did a few things the other day and um, then I'm done. Yeah. And then zone 
I guess I still need to do the nativity, which I will do when I do Friday's video. That might not happen either. I might end up doing that on Saturday. I don't think I've ever done my routine exactly, but does it, does it need to be? No. Progress, not perfection. Um, meaning I did it on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, like I have it planned. And then Tuesday, Thursday for the next week, every other week. The With rotating it like that, um, so on the, the weeks that there's only two two cleaning days um so next week it will be um zone one and zone two then it seems like zone three is skip but nope that will happen on monday so i'm still cleaning those zone the zone about every eight days not every seven days about every eight days the way it goes so i'll clean i cleaned the bedroom monday so next week, the zone, um, the bedroom will come up on Tuesday. And the next week, the bedroom will come up on Wednesday. Like that, it's about like every eight days. So it still gets plenty of time. Sometimes the zone only comes up three times a month and sometimes it comes up four times a month. It gets plenty clean, honestly. It's good. So I think it's gonna work. I'm just still tweaking it a little bit more. And uh, see how see how it goes. I want to go to Target and shut up here. <laughs> I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. I'm trying to make this darkness go away. I'll paint with colors and I'll sing until my lungs give out. Sunshine in the day, and I will leave my windows open so that I can hear the sound of people talking, and the wind blowing in the trees. Oh, I will open up my eyes so I can see the light. Oh, and I'll try to spread my wings so I can fly. starts to fade feels like things are gonna go my way i'm gonna let the sun shine in the day i'm gonna let the past be filled with smoke and i will try to fix what has been broken and take this weight off my shoulders because i know yesterday ain't coming back The next time I do my hair mask, I need to, that's the other thing. I need, I haven't been doing that. So I like to leave it on for like an hour and then, then rinse it out. That works better that way. I think I should drink this. It's warm. Yeah, I need to wet my whistle though. So it warmed up. The sun is shining. I don't know. It's three o'clock. How the heck did that happen? I want to say I started at nine, but maybe it was later. It was 10, but I wasn't expecting to do all that. So I'm not gonna show you everything that I got cause I kind of showed it. And they had, finally they had the seventh generation back in stock. They haven't had very much seventh generation back in stock for since the beginning, since March, whatever, or you know, probably May when everybody depleted it. And Jenna, I think it's you and me too that like the all purpose, the cemetery all purpose cleaner, the meadow something, meadow, meadow something. I don't remember. So they didn't have that. They had everything else though. In fact, they had the lemongrass disinfectant, all to all purpose um, surface cleaner disinfectant that kills 99% of germs. They had that back in stock, and I've not seen that in forever. What movie is that from? Forever. Right in the comments below if you know what movie that's from. So, um, and then other than that, I got 
um, I showed that, but I got the, the, um, three planners. I was just going to get one, but they were only $5. So uh, you'll see that, or maybe already seen that. Yes. And the, um, uh, did I show that? Cause I was also Instagramming too. So it's the one with the three dividers that I already bought, but I really like the purple one. But I already started using mine. So, but it's not gonna be enough for a year. I'll probably need two to three of these because I'm using sections for different things. So um, it only has 150 sheets. Or is that per divider? It has 150 sheets. That has got to be per, I don't know. So anyway, that was $5. And they don't have this online. They don't have this online. So go run to your store if I end up showing you in time um, and buy that. Um, yeah, so I got three of those. There was one more. And I'm like, three's enough. And I didn't really like the cover too much of the other one. So I didn't get that. And that's it. So I'm going to go, well, I'm going to text my sister and ask her if she's home. So I can go ahead and drop off the um, plate and the socks and the, the video. And um, I was going to go to the chiropractor. I don't feel like it. I'll go tomorrow. And cleaning, again, cleaning or not is not happening. So, you know, other than that, I got cow food, um, paper plates, Pringles, Ghirardelli chocolate chips, uh... Nothing really. I, I got a whisk because I don't have one and I've lived with that one for so long and I kept telling myself, oh, I can just use a fork, but no, because I was listening to Minimal Mom. She goes, you know, you have to decide for yourself, but um, she was saying, you know, you could just use a fork. Do you really need a whisk? Can you make do? I have made do, actually. For a, real, a really long time but then I was watching and of course I didn't find the one I, exact one I wanted but whatever it, I like it so I actually picked up a couple of them at um well I looked at a couple of them at marshmallows I'm like no I have to really like it otherwise I'm putting it back so but um Jen Chafin I've been watching her channel um she does like vlogs and she cooks and cleans and chit chats like me so she had a whisk it was like a little curly Q whisk but whatever it's fun I thought it was kind of cool and she said one of her subscribers told her about that so um yeah so again Jenna was that you that I I, I again I, I remembered somebody asked but I I can't remember who it is I'm terrible about that I, do, I don't retain that information but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say this Jenna let me know, Jenna, in the comments below. So, I'm not, I was supposed to text my sister. I'm in, yeah. Well, all right, the light's ready. Okay. And um, I bought myself another one of those Justin's Almond Butter Protein Bar. So, I can't see it. Anyway, so, and some blueberries to eat on the way home. I'm starving because I had a, a coffee, a banana, and a granola bar for um, breakfast, and I, I, I was didn't think I was gonna be gone that long. I, I always do that. What? That's just nuts. I should have either ate or brought something with me. So that's it, guys. Um, uh, I hope you enjoyed this car vlog, sort of, kind of. It was car vlog and shopping. All right. Call my sisters, get home and crash and burn. Until next time, enjoy your day.